taking you back to the issue of the spirit of Islamic Caliph in the mid 80s till the mid 90s, which was very, very vibrant, lively, and kicking. And يعني, nobody can control such a vibrant uh, soul of the organization. Because we used to depend at that time on the value and the quality of the young people. One of them, as I mentioned in the previous episode, was Fadis Kandrani. This one is Zahur Qureshi. Zahur Qureshi was originally from Pakistan with his family. And he was in the university at the age of 21, 22, something like this. And uh, I asked him to become my assistant and the one in charge of the organization, which was just a small office, nothing more than that. He had, he is, he, he had, a, he, he, he had a strong character and he was not yes sir man, but he was arguing and discussing and directing. Uh, and that's what I liked in him, alhamdulillah. The number of hours those young people used to do with us as voluntary activities was incredible, incredible, incredible. One time I put him in charge of the first Islamic Cleave Games, 1989. And uh, this was on 28th and 29th of October. And uh, we booked the Islamic sport, sorry, the, the Islamic center for us, Birmingham Islamic Center for the young people to come and sleep overnight, as well as we booked the uh, Birmingham Sports Center across the road to, uh, to play our, the games there, football, volleyball, and others. On the night of 28th and 29th, uh, it was the responsibility of the Hur to safeguard the safety of the mosque because the mosque allowed us to bring the young people to, sl to, to sleep in the mosque and the prayer hall, as well as to welcome the young people who are coming from different cities and different towns in, in, in UK. Uh, during this night, we're trying to find some way to entertain those people in the morning when they wake up to give them some breakfast. We bought. Uh, buns, we bought uh, soft cheese, we bought uh, uh, as well as butter and uh, to try to uh, give breakfast to those people. In the evening, it was the Hur who was sitting, uh, sleep sitting on a, on, on a very, very rough uh, on a chair at the gate of the mosque to do two things, to safeguard the safety of the mosque and not to allow anybody to come to the mosque uh, unless he knows uh, them. The second thing actually to receive the young people coming there to put them in the prayer hall in the mosque. You see, you can imagine a young man at this age يعني, sleep sitting on a chair. Plus next day he was responsible on organizing the people, the, 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 the players, the participants, as well as the spectators as well. This spirit was the drive of Islamic Cliff in the, from the beginning till the mid-90s before Islamic Cliff became a bureaucratic organization. Uh, who was leading this spirit at the time is actually the young volunteers of Islamic Cliff such as uh, Fadi Skandrani, Zahur Qureshi, uh, Fadi Aitani, uh, Anwar Khan, Jangir Malik, uh, and others, and others. Uh, please use the strong spirit of the young people when you want to build your organization. Don't ever undermine the role in building up your organization. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.